What is up, YouTube family? How are you guys doing today? It is a Monday. Like I said, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Like I said yesterday, I hope you guys are having a great week. It's over. At least the Monday is. <laughs> uh, we got a few more days for the week, but I hope you guys are taking care of yourself. We got some pretty fun things today. Um, I'm going to open up a little bit of everything we had gotten today. We got a Ryan Chu Hidden Fates tin so that's gonna be amazing hopefully we could pull the 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 shiny raw charizard uh pretty much only for uh selling purposes the other big one is obviously my favorite pokemon and i hope your guys is too shiny espion shiny scissor or shiny uh metagross now those are some of the few there's a few other ones like ho ho and everything now the other thing we have is a set of burning shadows now they're coming in three packs so we're gonna open one um kind of see how it goes to hopefully see if we could pull that hyper rare charizard so uh without uh any more delay let's get going now as you can see we have a unified mind uh meant to open up actually last video so we're gonna have uh that as like a as a break in between the fun we do have a whole set of these we have about 24 of these that i got on sale and of course hidden fates themselves so just like shiny shiny hunting shiny pokemon if you guys seen the the, the twitch channel we're gonna save that for last we're gonna bust out burning shadows first and kind of see where that leaves us so that pack just went flying awesome i know you guys are already stealing the code card that's not really stealing because that is for you and it always will be for you look at that coin my boy at a gross one of my favorite pokemon seriously and then the holographic promo cosmog which is going to be in the binder and then just so that you guys know for sure that is the code card now we get three packs of burning shadows now we don't have to worry about any shenanigans uh like we did with our booster box which i did find out was actually legit so yeah see these packs are stronger and everything i feel like the other ones were just really really strange um did get some good shiny or you know like uh hollows and gx's and stuff like that um it did come up with a secret rare so that was interesting so code card is for you guys this is uh what is this sun and moon so sun and moon has to be a four all right one two three four and we always guess the energy correctly i hope you guys at home are guessing correctly too we got Luna Stone, we got Plumera, Cedra, Aril, Totterpy, um, Flower Dude, a Skull, and I just punched out Nitoxagroke, and a non hollow Malamar. That's a funny one because uh, it reminds me of, I guess, a candy bar type of thing. So, yeah, see, these are definitely harder to open up. These are like kind of like some of the breakthrough packs <laughs> no 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 that was steam siege steam siege was really hard to open up remember all right let's see what we got here so we're gonna give you another code card got fabulous fabulous monday let's 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 get this monday uh let's keep this monday good good going uh bufflant sneasel crab brawler rolls ink a new Piter, reverse Osmeril and Aladian. So nothing, nothing good so far, or at least lucky. I hear Burning Shadows is like one of the harder sets to be pulling stuff. So uh, a green card, that's never a good sign. But I've noticed my luck, the white cards are no much better. I've seen like a lot of no hollows. So like, I don't understand the whole white versus green. It doesn't always pan out for me, so. And Seer, okay, we just saw the back card. I think it was a grass. So we got Magikarp, Meowth, Ormapod, and 
a toxic rope. So we may open up another pack of burning shadows on this fabulous Monday. If hidden fates, maybe, maybe we want to pull all our good RNG on hidden fates. Cause having that shiny, shiny Pokemon, if you guys seen the channel, we are currently shiny hunting. I'm talking about my other channel. We are currently trying to shiny hunting, um, uh, a shiny, uh, Inteleon. We're trying to get that, uh, shiny Sobble right now. Um, we've got, uh, our shiny hunting has, oh, our Vikavolt. I didn't even notice that. Uh, our shiny hunting has got us all, oh, got shiny Ghastly, shiny Flygon. Shiny, um, Espeon and Umbreon. So, and those are not from Pokemon Home. Those have all been from Pokemon Sword and Shield. So, you know, just more of um, me. I just, I just like collecting Pokemon. Uh, shiny hunting is always fun, especially in Sword and Shield. I used to do it back in the day, day when it used to be a lot harder. So, if you all remember those days, whew. Code card on uh, this. Now this is, remember, this is uh, Unified Minds. I have not pulled much uh, from Unified Minds as I do not uh, collect these a lot. So actually we have not pulled any good cards that I'm aware of. Um, and I am just mishandling these cards right now. Joltik, um, I did three, I think from the back. Oops. I gotta remember, Sword and Sh or Son of Moon, Son of Moon. Oh, this one feels a little weird. Like extra paper. All right. Unified Minds has Espeon, so maybe I should actually look into it to invest. Hmm? Oh man, Espeon's my favorite Pokemon. I hope it's yours. If not, if it's not your favorite Pokemon, what is your favorite Pokemon in the comments below? Seriously, if you guys, uh, you know, and if it's uh, if it's Charizard, let let us know. If it's Pikachu, let us know. Uh, we don't judge. Um, Pikachu is like one of my least um, oh, we spirit least favorite Pokemon uh, because it's just uh, it's just an electric you know rodent. So it's nothing like too crazy. But then again, hey, you can look at it anyways for every single Pokemon. So Hone Edge. Ooh, got a reverse. Look at that and. A Raichu, a Lolan Raichu GX card. Now that is an interesting card. Look at those happy good boys. Raichu is uh is definitely a better version of Pikachu. So I do appreciate the, the more Raichu you see. Um, obviously, obviously you see Raichu because of Pikachu, but still a good, cool looking Pokemon out there. So that's for you. All right. And it's only four. So energy is always, we, go, we always guess it. Remember, we always get it right. That's just how we do it here. Normal Z, Magnemite. I prefer to be a little abnormal. That's just me. Let's find our Snover, Lickitung, and a Toxapex non hollow. So, wow, we uh, we have not pulled that much today. Um, that is all right, though. That is how Mondays be sometimes. But maybe, just maybe, the hype is right here in front of us. Let's get this opened. Let's get a shiny Pokemon today. If not today, maybe next time, because we actually got a whole set of these. I got some Gyarados, some Charizard ones, and more Raichu Hidden Fate tins. So this is, uh, I actually have a lot of tins in my collection right now. So hopefully I could do, I might look up and see what I can do with them. But I'm not too sure. Um, that's the code for card for you guys. I'm not going to try to punch it out. We're just going to get right into it. A whole set of um, hidden fates here. Let's see here. 
hoping i'm rooting i'm rooting for some good uh some good shinies this is probably the only time i can get hidden fates on the channel so i'm actually really excited that i was able to do this so hidden fates um is considered sun and moon or x and y yeah it's sun and moon so uh four yep and i think i saw something already in the back so rocks uh city gym koga's trap eevee clefairy Psy, Psyduck, Ekans, Caterpie, and Reverse Hollow Mew, and we got a Wigglytuff GX card. Not exactly what we're looking for, but hey, hey, at least we got something unlike some of the other packs that we've opened up today. Is Mew uh, a rare? It is, it's a reverse rare. Well, that is good to know. Um, Really good to know. So, this one feels different. This pack, it opens super easy. It feels heavier. I wonder, you guys. I wonder, I might lead you, I might be leading you guys up right now. Hey, you know, we're about to find out in a few moments. We got some energy that we always be guessing. We got a Chansey, Rock's Grit, a Scyther, a Charmander, Saduk. Magikarp, Star U. Okay, I see an electric Pokemon in the back, so. And a reverse Snorlax, ah. and a Jolteon. Okay, well, that one felt like a different type of pack, but uh, definitely wasn't. So. Um, I think it's just the way these packs were kind of just crammed into the tin. So, it is fine. Hopefully, we can get some good stuff. Like that one. Had a white card, but it had no hollow. Like I said, it's really weird how like people seem to think that the white and green cards are supposed to tell you something, but it doesn't actually work for me that way. It's um, it always seems to be sort of opposite at times, so I can never count on that. Um, uh, we always be guessing energy. We got a Jinx. Um, now I know from a. Um, looking it up, uh, the, the, the shiny is supposed to be in the reverse hollow spot. So, and we get a shiny pseudo and a regular Lapras. Well, that is a win already. We got our first shiny Pokemon. Let's put that in a sleeve. Hell yeah. One last pack that we must, we might burn out, uh, burn out. We might burn out too. Who knows? We might bust out another Burning Shadows pack because that was a little lackluster. Um, I'm rooting for some good packs, you guys. It's a, it was a good, it was a good, uh, deal. The set was awesome. Burning Shadows is always super hype. So, um,. Let's just, uh, let's hope we get something good here. So we got a Scyther, or no, a Warp, a Metapod, sorry. A uh, Sabrina, Chameleon, Clefairy, Jigglypuff, Caterpie, Eevee, Ekans, and... Oh, yeah! Not the bird I prefer, Zapdos. Oh my god. And then a Jesse James Hollow. Bro. Okay. We got a shiny legendary bird. This is a supreme win. Full art. Dude. Dudes, you guys. Dudes. Oh my gosh. Oh man. That is a Pokemon card opening. Oh my god, I'm so happy that I hope I got these tens, you guys. Look at that. Look at that. Now, that's not all. Let's quickly jump into another. Oh, bam. So. Um, that bird. Oh, man. That might be like the picture of the of the video. We'll see Move that a little bit back so that I don't squash anything because that is definitely going to be um, in a set that I'm going to try to get graded. 
Um, I don't know about the other ones, but Articuno is definitely going to be. So, um, and then code card that is upside down for you. Cosmogon over there. All right. Now, what can these bur uh, burning shadows bring us? Like I said, um, burning shadows seems to be like a really hard um, kind of um, set. Now, the downside with these is, like I said, these are the three packs, the blister packs. So they're supposed to give you a chance of supposedly anything. Um, there's no guaranteed, you know, um, like how we got that dumbbell. No, we got the dumbbells. Uh, there's no guaranteed like ultra secret or something apparently or whatever. So um, let's just oh, four. So let's uh, let's keep rooting, you guys. You know, we got the energy that we always guess correctly. I hate this thing so much. Uh, Gast, um, more flower power. Crab brawler. We got a stuffle. Ink. Olivia. <laughs> And we got a Charizard. We got a Charizard GX, you guys. You know, I might actually start to become a fan of a Charizard. I can see why a little bit why sometimes they always be giving Charizard the art. Look at this thing. Look at this art. Good Lord, man. I mean, it's going to be definitely maybe in its uh, uh, in the collection. Um, definitely. I mean, just just look at the the art that they be giving Charizard half the time. So that is definitely awesome, awesome. We did pull a Charizard. Holy crap! Um, not the secret rare. Or no, wait, is Charizard a secret? No, it's a hyper rare. There is hyper rare. There's a rainbow version of the of a Charizard in this set. Um. And then the Hidden Fates has a black shiny Charizard that you can pull. So there is different Charizards in both of these sets that we can pull. What are the odds that we might actually pull both in one video? Who knows? Uh, we got a Reverse Gyarados, which I've pulled that actually quite a few bit times. And Intoxicroak, which we pulled that in the last pack. So... Um... Let's give the last pack some magic, some uh, some hands up, hands up in the chat. That's be four from the back, so let's give it a go. And it's always the fairy energy. We always be guessing it. We got a Charmeleon, we got a Wormapod. Uh, I already saw the grass, so we know it's not a Char Charizard, but that is all right. We got a Donkey, we got a Magikarp, eat more. And a Butterfree on Hollow. Well, that's it, everybody. That's the Taze's video. That's awesome. We pulled a Charizard. We pulled a Shiny Bird. Like, you cannot... You cannot, like, get upset with these two. Look at this. The camera's looking like it's... It's... These birds flying. We also got a Shiny Pseudowoodle. We can't be upset with that. So, that is amazing. I hope you guys are amazing. Seriously, you guys take care of yourself out there. I know more stuff is happening with the way that... Uh, you know, just the virus and everything. So stay safe. Take care of yourself. Always be kind to each other. Please, please, please. Things are getting crazy out there. Um, also, um, we're going to keep going with these videos. We got some more hidden fates. We got more burning shadows. Of course, we got, always got more breakthrough. So we got more Pokemon, more fun, more video games. Don't worry. I promise video games in this channel several times. We're going to have quite a few videos of video games. I might make it a whole week, just a video section of video games I've collected over the years and maybe give you guys some ideas of plans of video games I'm planning on collecting. So other than that, you guys have a wonderful day. I'll see you all next time. Oh, and remember, butter up your manatee.